Hello there, everybody, and welcome to the jungle. Welcome back to the jungle. I'm still in the jungle. I live in the jungle. The jungle's my home. How are y'all doing? Um, I went ahead and did a little bit of work between episodes this time because it was just very repetitive and tedious. I did go ahead and finish my little house here. Hello, house. This is my house. Oh. Um, I probably should... Uh, just got an open doorway here. This will eventually have a door in it. We're just gonna kind of throw some lights in here so it's more visible from a distance. Speaking of which, let's replace this torch with a fresh one just to make sure it doesn't run out. All right, the name of the game today, tonight. Tonight, it is night. The sun has just set, it's very dark out. The name of the game is Metal. Metal is the name of the game. It's the metal game. Game of metal. Um, I actually don't need that hammer right now. Maybe I should free up some inventory space. Well, you know what? I'm probably not going to find that much metal to begin with. Uh, what I need to do, I need to take this pick. I need to go to the places where I found copper nuggets before, and I need to dig up the good, good copper underground, which is underneath it. Um, oh boy, it's going to be a little extra challenging because of the, the dirt physics that we've got here now. I am going to grab these nugs, these nugs right here, grab these little nugsies, and start digging down, hopefully without causing a massive cave-in on myself here. All right, so it's going to be underneath here. Hmm, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to go one, one further down. Do I have any cob on me? I do not, and I should probably bring some cob so I can pillar out of any dangerous situations. Always good to have a little cob on you, because that is the easiest block to make that is not affected by gravity in the game now. With the, uh, with the physics turned on, as I do have, because I'd like a little extra challenge. There we go. We got, we got some cob. We got some cob. I can use that to dig out after. All right, so, um, I'm getting copper. What do we got here? We've got rich copper ore. Oh, that is good news, friends. So what I'm planning to do, as I think I mentioned last time, is I'm going to go straight for an anvil and, uh, and get that saw. I need a saw. I do need a saw. I have not made the mold for the anvil yet. I will have to do that as well. Um, but yeah, progress is being made at a pretty good pace here. I am also going to go back to where there was some... Um, Got any more? Oh, we got more. Uh, I'd like to go back to where those pigs are are penned in. My little piggy friends. And, uh, oh, I'm getting a lot of frame drops. I'm not sure why, folks. I'm not sure why. Oh, there's even more down here. I'm glad I checked. I almost didn't check. Can you believe that? Can you imagine if I had not checked? I don't know why uh, the frame rate is so poor at the moment. Um, I am on version, I think this is 1.12.6. Uh, which is also the version my server is still on. There have been updates, folks. There have been several updates, as a matter of fact. Um, I am waiting until it actually stabilizes, right? Until Tyrone decides, okay, I'm gonna stop messing with it, because it seems like there's a new update, like, every day at the moment. Um, and I don't want to have to keep updating, especially since uh, I am running a server, and when I update the server, I've got a... I've got a uh, go in and, and update my mods as well, like my own little personal modifications. Let's go ahead and make the anvil mold now. I've got a hammer already. I mean, I've got, there's, there's plenty of clay around, right? This isn't a case uh, uh, like in the previous one where, oh, I, I, need, I need to just click, you have to move too slowly and it's bad for my wrist to hold down the mouse button like that. Um, this isn't a case like the previous one where I don't have the clay for molds. There's plenty of clay. There's clay all over the place. We've got oodles of clay. Oodles and oodles of clay. Uh, however, I'm, the reason I'm making the beeline for the anvil is because I want the anvil only tools. I want to get that saw. More than anything in the world, I want to get that saw. So, I'm going to have to go for it. I probably don't have enough clay to make the whole anvil mold right now, actually. I'm also going to need to make some ingot molds. That's going to be key. Very, very paramount importance, because you need ingots in order to use the anvil. You can't just you can't just take a whole bunch of molten copper in your hands and just start start smithing it. It just doesn't work that way, folks. I'm sorry. 
I am sorry, but that's just the way it is. All right. So we've got... Whoops, that's the wrong button. Come on, Ira. I know you're talking around a microphone right now. You're working around a microphone, but you still need to hit those keys accurately. you got to focus up. Focus up, Ira. Here we go. It's not actually too bad making an anvil. I've made so many of these at this point. It's it's slightly bananas. Like when I think about how many times I've done some of these tasks in the various playthroughs of the game that I've done, it just feels a little bit crazy. I am gonna have to yeah, I'm gonna have to go get some more clay. Oh, there is more clay right over here actually. It's very dark now. So it's gonna be a little hard harder to find my way. Uh, but I think this is closer. Is it down here? can't really see. You, you you folks may actually be able to see better than me right now because I have got the glare of the sun coming through my window. There's a light over there. Did I put that light over there? What is this light over there? Is that my light? This might be, it might be my light. I might have put down a light. That's a torch. That's a torch that I put down. Presumably to help me remember where some ore was. So actually let's just go ahead while we're here. We've come over this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. We're gonna one, we need one more. We got it. We got it. Okay. Um, down we go. Um, let's just go down one more so that we don't... Oh, there it is! There's the copper! And this is more rich copper ore! That's fantastic! Folks! We, we've hit the big time. There's not much here. There's gotta be more. There's gotta be more here. Surely there's more here. Where's the rest of it? Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. You don't have just three pieces of rich copper in the middle of nowhere with nothing else around them. Is that really it? I think that's it, folks. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We got more. It's up here. It's up here, folks. Okay. I went down too low. Everything's fine. We took care of it. Found the rest of the copper. Whew, that actually worried me. I need that good copper. Ooh, there's a, there's a fancy one right there. It's a very special... special little piece. Um... Oh, no, there wasn't. I could have sworn I saw one of those fancy ones. I may be losing my mind just a little bit. I mean, it's been known to happen. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm fine. Everything's okay, folks. A small heart attack. It was. It was only a small one. I'll survive. In fact, I have survived. It just. It just gave me a little spook. A little startle. It's okay. All right, that probably is it. I guess. Six days left before monsters start to appear. Good to know. Thank you for letting me know. Game. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> let's get out of here. And we're out. Okay, so this is the way back. Where was that? That clay was not this far away. I think it was probably off to the side somewhere, and I probably walked right past it, and I'm just not seeing it good on account of the glare that I mentioned before. There it is. Loads of clay. Okay. Let's just get a bunch of clay. And I seem to also um, be having... A little bit of the visual lag problems again, still. I feel, like, I feel like they went away and then they came back, but the weird thing is I haven't updated the game since that went away. So I don't know why it's suddenly back. Uh, but I have been having more of the visual trouble recently with this game. That's probably adds a lower stack. We're good. Alright, we'll head back. Head back and uh, make some more molds. The light, the light in the distance. There's a light. Okay, no, I can't be saying copyrighted materials. YouTube didn't like that at all. They have um they have a policy about that. Actually, let's let's take the full stack. I don't know why I only took the three pieces. That's not gonna get me very far. Alright, here we go. Just like nothing ever happened, we're back. <laughs> back making this anvil mold. That's good stuff. I've been playing on the server more uh, than I've been playing in here, actually. And a matter of fact, uh, this episode is gonna... I've been, I've been putting these episodes out on Mondays, but this one is probably gonna come out on a Tuesday, because I'm actually only just recording it on the Monday. I actually ran out of pre-recorded material, because I spent too much time. And this is a fact, this is a true fact. I spent too much time playing on the server. <laughs> and, uh... I, I, I ran out of content. Ran out of episodes. I feel a little bit sheepish about it. Somehow I sort of thought I had plenty, and then I realized, oh no, I, I already used them all. All used up. Why can't I? There we go. That was. I felt stuck for a moment there. 
But again, we resolved it and everything's fine. No one needs to worry. No one needs to worry about me. I live in the jungle. That's all. I find this to be the easiest way to do the ingots. Rather than putting each of those little bits right there, and then you just go bup, 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 up, bup, 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 up. You don't, but not like that, because I just missed I just missed it. And then you just copy paste, copy paste to the next layer, and there you go, they're all done. See how easy that was? Oh look, sticks. Sticks are good. Um, I should probably make a tool rack. Have I not made a tool rack? I don't think I have. It's been a little while since I've been playing this. I don't think I made a tool rack yet. Let's make a tool rack. Hang up the tools we're not using at the moment. Let me just stick them up here for now. Just stick them on the outside. Uh, not using these at the moment. I'm sure I'll need them soon. Don't need them yet. I can just save a little inventory space. Bump. There we go. Might as well just keep some torches on my hotbar, huh? Is this gonna have enough? Probably not. Let's go. Let's just stick one more log on that fire. Okay. Uh, I actually want to make. Since I have the clay, let's make one more set of these ingot molds. And we can do four at a time. Always useful to be able to do more at once. And I'll, I'll make more uh, tool mo molds later. Probably off camera, because I don't think I'm going to need them today. Oh, 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 there we go. I did it properly that time. That's how you do it. The way I did it before, I was just kidding. <laughs> it's not how you do it. Stick those in there, it's gonna reset the temperature, but that's fine. Hey, we did it! Got the anvil mold, stick that there. Um, and we've got the charcoal. So let's take these and see how many nugs we got. We got a good number of nugs. That's a pretty decent, that's a pretty decent number of nugs there. So to make the anvil, I need, uh, 900 units, which is, oh gosh, I should know the math by now. One, one, an anvil is like nine ingots. One ingot is 20 pieces. Nine times 20 is 180 pieces. We do have 180 pieces. Not, not really any more than that, though. That's 180 pieces. That's 900 units of copper ingot. And we don't have enough for any others. I know I've got more. Not enough. Not enough. We're gonna have to get some more. Oh, man. Went through that awful quick, didn't we? Alright, well, that's okay. We can at least get this done. Let's see if this is enough. Oh, that should relight itself right away. There we go. I don't have to do it myself. How are these doing? We got one. Probably gonna need more wood, because we got so many in the fire. How is the time doing? It is still night. <laughs> Kind of hoping the sun is going to come up soon because yeah, we're, we're the moon is going down. I still got a bit of a time left. Um, I want to go back to where those pigs are and get the tin that I found there. Um, actually, should I should I go straight for it? You know what? I hate to do it, but I'm actually going to set this aside and I'm going to wait. I know I just wasted one, but that's okay. We can do, we can, you can just put a stick in there. <laughs> we'll just make a torch. Um, I'm gonna wait till I get the tin, because I can probably get enough tin. Hopefully I can get enough tin to make a uh, bronze anvil, because eventually I'm gonna need a bronze anvil anyway. Oh, the nuggets just fell on the ground. Almost left them there. They're hot, hot nuggets. <laughs> These are hot nugs, folks. I have way too much stone as well. I wish, do you know what I wish? I wish we could put the charcoal back down in the pile after we've picked it up, like just put the layers back down. Like the, you could do it in um, Terraforming Craft, which is what this pack was inspired, or this is what this game was inspired by. But for whatever reason, oh no, I don't have any space left. I can't do that. It's fine. Oh, it's not fine. All right, well, then let's go, uh, let's go get some sticks. Take my ax. Oh, it's so dark. Here we go. I need six sticks. That's two. Six in total. Four, five. Look at that. Right here from one tree. I got my six sticks. Now we can hang up these extra tools. 
Just kind of killing time a little bit. There we go. So, um, got more rocks than I need. It's fine. Can hang up this. I'll keep the pick. Actually, I should take a shovel. I can go over there now, but it's just so dark. You know? It's just so dark. Don't need that. Let's save wood where we can. We're gonna be ecological. Get this out of here. Uh, and then maybe I'll start making my way back over towards where the pigs are. Because... I'm gonna get that, I'm gonna get that tin. Let me get that tin. I don't know if I'm gonna remember uh, where all the rest of the copper was. I think I went that way to get the copper before. I am gonna need a lot more, clearly. I don't have quite as much as I thought I did. We still have a little Piggly Wiggly down in a trap down here, right? Where are you, Piggly Wiggly? You're right over here somewhere. I'd find you easier if it weren't so dark out. The wind, wind in the trees. Sounds nice. I like it. I like that sound. All right, it is, it is very dark. Again, the glare in the window behind me. It's a bright sunny day, which is nice. I love that sunshine, but it does make recording difficult. We've had like three overcast rainy days in a row. And ow. And of course, the the day when I decide to record is the day when we got the sunshine and bright bright behind me can't see down there but the moon is setting the sun should be up soon the sky is lightening just ever so slightly over here over over behind those other trees um i don't know if i'm gonna be able to easily find these pigs in the darkness i know roughly what direction to go in here but i need that sunlight i need the sun to help me find my way put a torch over there was that more actually i think that might have been more tan over there Oh, I hear a Piggly Wiggly. Uh, maybe it's copper. Maybe it's tin. You're probably all watching this going, Ira, we already know what it is. You should just go back and rewatch your old videos. Guys, I didn't have the time. I don't have time to go back and rewatch old videos. It takes, it takes more time than I have. All right, what do we got? Do we got something? Oh, it is tin. Good job, past me. You done. You done well. Let's go this way. Okay. Oh, it's right there as well. Super. Although that's actually going to be kind of difficult because that means the. Let's. Please don't collapse on me. Okay. Uh, we might get some cave-ins happening. In fact, it's quite likely. Quite likely that we're gonna get some cave-ins happening here. Uh, it is gonna be poor quality because it is always, as far as I am aware... Ow! Oh boy! <laughs> can kinda use that to look through the world a little bit, huh? Um, it's always poor quality cassiterite for the surface deposits. It's, it's... It can be a little frustrating, because tin is hard enough to find as it is, but I have increased the, uh, the spawn rate of tin in this world. So... It's not gonna be quite as- Oh goodness, I wasn't standing far back enough, apparently. Thought I was. I was wrong. I was mistaken. So each one of these is just gonna have one nugget in it. Once we break it open. That's all we get. One nug. One nug each. Oh, man. Getting, getting more dirt than I really need at the moment. Does there happen to be any more? Probably not. These are usually pretty small. Alright. Let's head. Now the sun is up, which is great. I'm gonna take this torch so I don't confuse myself. And the pig should be right over this way somewhere. Oh, it's, it, the sun came up so quickly. I was all focused on getting, um, getting that tin. Also, when I was editing the footage for the previous episode, I did notice some terra preta around here somewhere. I don't know exactly where it was, but it was in this region. Near where I found the pigs. 
I don't know if I'm gonna find it again now, but it's a good thing to, to be aware of. Oh, there's a structure over here that I definitely didn't see before because it was dark out. I'm always out wandering in the darkness like a fool. Let's go check this out and see what's in there. I don't think I found this before. Kinda hope I didn't, otherwise I'm wasting my time. My time is precious, we can't be wasting it. I do see some, some chickens there. I'm not gonna kill them, I'm good on food for the moment. I just leave these chickens here. Now uh, maybe we can come back eventually. Give them some food. Maybe negotiate a little uh, exchange. Ooh, some seeds. These will be tools, right? Yep. What do we get for tools? Anything good? No, nothing good. That's okay. I'm already in a good mood, tool vessel. So I just got some tin and I'm about to get some more. It was right at the spot where I had the pigs kind of penned in. Pig pen, if you will. Where exactly was it? Is it further this way? Should have put a torch down, and I don't think I did. I don't think I was quite... I didn't have the wherewithal. Take care of that. Up here somewhere? It was, it was sort of just inside the tree line, I remember that much. Oh, goodness. I'm so sorry, folks. I, I don't know if the frame rate on the video will be any better than it is on my monitor. Because I think I have uh, OBS set to take priority. But if it's real choppy, I am sorry. I'm doing the best I can. I don't know why it's suddenly so choppy. Um, I'm doing the best I can. What can I say? If I can think of a way to make it less choppy, I will do so. But I think it's just, it's just the sheer rendering necessities of this jungle are just kind of absurd. I feel like I've gone much too far. Maybe I should go back and rewatch my video from before. I'm probably not going to do that though, folks, I'm going to be honest with you. Was it further towards my base? I really thought it was right around here somewhere. Oh, it must have been because here's a pig. Where's your friends? Where's your family members? Are they nearby? They must be nearby. They cannot be far. Here, piggies, 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 piggies. It's, uh... It's me. I'm just coming to visit. I'm actually not here to kill any of you. So if you could just make some noise so that I could find you. Back over here now. Couldn't have been that far. Couldn't have been this far. I know there were trees around it. Quite sure there were trees around. Well, I'll tell you what, folks. Like, I'm not in danger, really, I don't think, of getting lost without my map and coordinate system. Oh, there it is! How many times have I walked past this, folks? Well, you screamed at me. I'm so sorry. I couldn't hear you because I'm recording this in the past. Here's the piggies. Two piggies. Good. Two pig- there's another piggy there! I wonder if I could, like, gently encourage this piggy to join its friends. Probably. Come and get me! Yeah? Yes! Lovely! And here's my tin! Everything is coming up, Ira. It's all good. Everything is just splendid at the moment. Got all these nuggets everywhere. Somebody posted a comment on uh, my previous video. I was complaining about um, how there's kind of a delay before you can pick items up off the ground, and I don't like it. And I said I prefer it in Minecraft where you can pick stuff up instantly, and apparently, according to this, uh, this commenter who took the time to explain it to us, it's not instant in Minecraft either. It just feels like it is because there's a greater distance where you can pick stuff up. So that means, you know, you break something and as you're walking away, the stuff still goes into your inventory because you don't have to be right next to it like you do in this game. So that's interesting, interesting information. So that is why I get so frustrated with stuff just being left on the ground as I walk away. It's because it really, it, it works differently than Minecraft, which is, you know, game we're usually comparing this one to because they are the most similar and it, this one was inspired by Minecraft even though it has very much gone on to do its own thing and is a totally different game now um, 
Yeah, I, so I, I, I will I will take back what I said about I, I prefer the way that it's instant in Minecraft, because now I know it's not instant. Instead, I will say I prefer the way the pickup distance is, is longer, apparently, in Minecraft. Assuming that that commenter is correct, and I have no reason to doubt them. All right, I think this is all we- this is a much bigger deposit, I appreciate that. There was more though, wasn't there? Yes, there's more up here. Wow. Well, pretty good. Pretty good stuff. Oh no, whoop! I'm a fool! You knew that. This is not news to any of you. All right, I think we got it all. Let's get our butts out of here. Just our butts. The rest of us can stay. Oh, actually, it seems that the rest, uh, the, 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 the rest of me is following my butt, so... I guess... I guess, I guess my entire body is going. Let's put a torch there this time, so... <laughs> slightly easier time finding space. Although, now that I'm going home in the daylight, I think I won't have so much trouble remembering my way. I do wanna... I don't remember exactly where that terra preta was, but it was somewhere right around here. Right around where I first saw the pigs. Habitat. To spot it. I am gonna grab it. Don't... There it is! Look at it. It's so easy to miss, isn't it? It's amazing how easy that is to miss. Oh! Oh my goodness! Massive frame drop! What is going on? Oh, my inventory's full. Look at these stupid rocks! I don't need them. There we go. Let's grab this very good soil. Then we'll head home. I will melt down this ore. We'll make that, uh... I think we'll make that anvil. Oh, there's more copper! Grab that. Oh, the framiness is absolutely killing me, though, folks. I do not understand why the sudden super framiness. I hate it when they're right right on the surface like that. <laughs> with the With the... Uh, dirt, cavins. Stand back. Stand back. That's the plan. Plan is stand the heck back. There might not be much here. Or maybe it's just deeper down. We can go deeper down a little bit. Got any, got any more? Oh, it's a little bit. I think this is not a good deposit. Although it is rich. It's rich every time. What luck we have had with the copper. That is going to go a long way. Yep. <laughs> playing dodge the dirt today. World champion Ira playing dodge the dirt. All right. I think that's probably it. I'm not gonna worry about. Whoa! I've lost my title at dodge the dirt. I'm so embarrassed. I'm so ashamed. There it is, folks. Just as the rain starts drizzling down. Let's fill up this anvil mold with 900 units of liquid tin bronze. Going straight for bronze, my friends, because we can. Awesome. I'm gonna let that harden up. I'm gonna probably make some more tool molds and stuff off camera. And in the next episode, my friends, we're gonna do some more metalworking and probably go out looking for a little bit more food because I'm getting a little bit low. That's all I got left. All right, folks, that's it. We're out of time. You gotta go now. But I'll see y'all soon. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time, folks. Bye-bye. Good morning, everyone. Hello. It's morning. That's why there's this bright light shining on my face. Because there's underneath all these names of these wonderful patrons of mine, there's a window. And it's morning and it's sunny. And I have allergies. And you might be asking yourself, Ira. That would be asking me. You might be asking yourself, self. Why did Iris say that this video was going to be out on a Tuesday? She, she said it in the middle of the video. This is coming out on a Tuesday. And today, when this video is actually coming out, is clearly a Wednesday. Unless something else has gone horribly wrong, and this comes out later than that. But presumably it's coming out on a Wednesday. What? Why that thing? Why did that happen? Well, it's because I have allergies. I have allergies. <laughs> and I'm completely out of it all the time. I am. This is me on allergy medication, non-drowsy allergy medication. My allergies are so severe during this time of year that I barely, I am a barely functioning pile of sludge because the trees are out there making their murder dust. And so a lot of stuff, I don't finish it when I think I'm going to. And I feel bad about it. And 
I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I might actually, um... I'm, I'm, I, going forward, some of these videos might not have these little end credit segments on them just because... This is actually the hardest part of making the video. Because <laughs> they kind of be like, I need to look at a camera. And people are gonna see what I look like, and it's not good at the moment. Um... And I have to come up with something interesting to say and then have the energy to speak aloud in this time when nobody's going outside legally without a face mask and an urgent reason to be out. Uh, and I'm not used to speaking <laughs> anymore. So uh, there, there might be some videos without these little uh, outro segments just in, in, in the name of getting stuff out a little bit more efficiently. But I'll still be doing my streams, so if you want to see my allergy-ridden face, that's going to be the, the place and time to do it. It's going to be Wednesdays and Saturdays. It depends on your time zone. If you're in my time zone, which is Central Europe, then it's at, at 6 p.m. That's GMT plus one, I think. It's all crazy now, because America's in, in, in uh, the government is lying about what time it is land already, and we haven't quite gotten to the government is lying about what time it is. Uh, I think that's coming this weekend. Oh, God. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.